did a COVID-19 patient in New Mexico get the virus? How can we stop this from happening again? UNM scientists are trying to figure all of that out. News 13's Francesca Washington spoke to local doctors about their research. She's here with details. Using samples from people who tested positive for coronavirus, researchers are getting a better idea of where the virus started and how it will continue to spread. We can actually get an estimation of the total number of infections potentially in the state. UNM scientists are taking a closer look at the coronavirus. And those molecular clues, as we call them, are, are what gives us the ability to kind of track how the virus is spreading. Those molecular clues are genomes. We compare the genetic sequences or the genome sequences of the viruses we're seeing in New Mexico. From that genetic sequence, they can determine how the virus we're seeing here compares to strains around the nation. We could see if the early cases in New Mexico for example, we can see that they're similar to viruses that are coming out of New York or coming out of Europe. That gives us an indication that they probably came from those places as well. They can also determine how the virus is entering and spreading in the community. We see a cluster of samples that were six or seven samples and they all have the exact same genome sequence of the virus. That suggests they all got infected within a week or two of each other, potentially either through direct contact or maybe a shared contact. Doctors Daryl Dinwiddie and Daryl Doman say so far they've tested 48 genomes from New Mexico and have 1,400 more ready for testing. Information from those tests will tell them how long the virus has been spreading and what it might do next. This gives and empowers our public health officials to make informed decisions about what sort of public health policies need to be implemented. By the end of the week, the research team expects to have some projections for how many more cases we could see here in New Mexico. Jess, back to you. All right, thank you, Francesca. New Mexico is one of 19 states working with the CDC to generate the genome sequencing data. Domino's